Welcome to the Building Operations Control Center, located in our Systems Engineering Building. At PNNL, we call it our nerve center for interactive building operations and controls. This center enables us to achieve our ambitious goal of a net zero greenhouse gas emissions with 24-7 carbon-free energy by 2030. In other words, we're not only going to be net zero on average over a year, but our energy will come from clean sources at every hour in the day. How will we achieve this? Let's take a moment to explore a few unique attributes of our campus located in Richmond, Washington. First, we have a strong partnership between our scientists and engineers and our professionals who manage our facilities and operations. This includes our union workforce. This collaboration allows us to take technology being developed through our research programs and deploy it right here across our campus to improve operations, using our own campus as a living laboratory. Second, we partner with our local municipalities to provide utilities directly to the point of service. This provides us highly reliable services at a more efficient cost. And finally, we have proudly demonstrated our enduring commitment to excellence and sustainability. We have been recognized by the U.S. Department of Energy and other entities receiving numerous awards over the past decade. We received the Department of Energy's award in Sustainability and Resilience Planning, recognizing our innovative approach and commitment. It's PNNL's strong culture around sustainability that has been essential in ensuring DOE's continued success as a federal leader in the field. Our sustainability culture will enable PNNL to achieve our aggressive net zero emissions and energy resilient operations goal. Another aspect that will be important to achieving our net zero goal is our buildings. Did you know 75% of all electricity in the US is consumed by buildings? By optimizing our energy consumption through interactive instrumentation and controls, we'll be able to operate our buildings and laboratories more efficiently. Let me show you one of the monitoring systems that we use right here in the Building Operations Control Center. This image shows you the level of instrumentation and controls deployed here at our campus. Right here, we're looking at the heating and cooling unit for this very room. We're able to monitor airflow in and out. We can control dampers, monitor temperature, and control the fan speed, all using multiple data points, allowing us to make adjustments as needed. With this level of instrumentation and controls on our major systems, we have a platform for our research to develop the next generation of interactive and efficient controls for our facilities. Let me tell you about one of our transactive control technologies developed right here at PNNL. Voltron is an open source distributed control and sensing software platform for data collection, management, and analysis. Think of this like an app on your phone, it's collecting data and making decisions. We have deployed Voltron in 16 buildings in a Richland campus. Those buildings are instrumented with more than 10,000 sensor points, generating more than 14 million records each day. This data has allowed us to reduce energy use and consumption by facilities between 10 and 20%. We can quickly address operational issues and identify where we need to make system modifications or changes as we continue to invest in our campus. Voltron is also being used in other locations across the nation, such as Penn State University, University of Toledo, Spokane, Washington in the South Landing Eco District, and the City of Washington, D.C.'s Department of General Services. Why this is important is 85% of buildings in the U.S. don't have any type of building management systems. Voltron, it's a scalable, affordable way to deploy building operation technology to any community. I hope you have enjoyed this portion of our Building Operations Control Center tour. We're co-locating our research and operations staff enables rapid deployment of our technologies to our campus operations, which is central to achieving our ambitious goal of a resilient net zero campus.